today I'm coming at you guys with another room decor DIY project. But some of these are so easy that they're kind of just life hacks and they're kind of Tumblr Pinterest inspired so yeah a lot of people seem to like that Tumblr Pinterest vibe. I made myself get a little bit more organized. I think we could all use a little more organization if you're like me. If you're not, then kudos to you and you should make a video. So I hope that you guys enjoy this video and get organized slash make your room look really cool and let's get into it. For this, you will need some pebbles, nail polish, and some command tape. I'm starting with four pebbles and I'm leaving four of them white and painting four of them with this gold colored nail polish. You can do whatever color you want but I thought this gold glitter color looked really good. You're gonna have to let them dry and then you can flip them over and paint the other side of them. Then cut a piece of command tape Put it on the pebble and then you can peel it off and press it to your wall. You're going to want to hold it there for about 20 seconds to make sure that it stays there permanently. I skipped that just because why would you want to watch me put this on for 20 seconds? But yeah, it's actually so easy and this is a great way to hang your jewelry. This is going to help your shirts stay on so that your closet is organized and things don't fall off of hangers. Take a pipe cleaner and just wrap it around the edges of a hanger. And then cut off the extra. And now your shirt will grip to the pipe cleaner and it won't fall off and make your closet all messy. Because that happens to me all the time, but this is really awesome. For this, I'm using a piece of cardstock and liquid gilding and a pencil, and I'm just using the eraser to make polka dots. So I got the inspiration from the background of my computer, and if you just make a bunch of polka dots, you can put them randomly everywhere. And then you're going to want to let this dry for an hour. After that, you can measure it up against your frame and cut off the extra so that it fits inside the frame. And then you can just place it inside and close it. And it is done. The glass works as a whiteboard so you can just write things to do on it. I wrote that you should thumbs up this video because you should totally do that right now. Okay, so this is really easy to make. Take some painter's tape and just place it into a square. And then paint the inside of the square with chalkboard paint. After you let it dry, you can peel off the painter's tape and you have a label that you can write on with chalk. If you have thinner chalk than this sidewalk chalk, then whatever you write is going to look a lot better. I know this is pretty sloppy, but this is so great because I always lose hair ties and now I have a place for them. To make this ring dish, you need a plate, a candle holder, and a bowl. So take some E6000 glue and just glue it onto the bottom of the candle holder and then press it down for 30 seconds. And then you're gonna repeat the same thing to the top of the candle holder with the bowl. After that, it's pretty much done. This is really actually so easy to make. So that is the video. I hope that you guys enjoyed this. Be sure to like it if you did and follow me on all the social medias that everyone always says, including Snapchat. I'm just going to have them linked below. You probably know the drill. If you have it, then I probably also have it and follow me on it. Leave a comment below on which of these was your favorite. Mine is the pipe cleaner one around a hanger changed my life because my closet is actually organized now and stuff isn't on the floor. So yeah, hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys soon. Okay, bye!